Now we're going to explore educational technology or ed tech as a socio-cultural phenomenon. Essentially, the rise of educational technology and its impact upon society. Now, educational technology is having a big impact upon education, uh, particularly in the Western world. And it is a response to a range of different socio-cultural influences and factors. Um, one has been, particularly in the United States, the increasing cost of education. And educational technology has been seen as both a justification and a reason for this increased cost. Um, there's also a general shift in society in how we treat education. Um, it being seen much more as a means of government oversight and of, um, it's become commercialized and the free market has been given sway over influencing what occurs within education, particularly in the field of educational technology. And this has been quite a shift from the past where education has been somewhat um, protected from commercial influences. Now with educational technologies in particular, we're seeing a lot more influence by the commercial sector on educational practices. And there's also the general belief that education as a process can be automated, um, much more so than, well, it, it was also much seen as such in the um, 50s and 60s, but it's had a resurgence and education being seen as a procedural process that um, children can go through and teachers can support and technology can play a major factor in that um, mechanistic process. Now, of course, this neglects many of the other humanistic aspects of education, which traditionally have held much greater sway. But that's definitely been an area where things have been trending. And finally, there's a general belief that technology is a solution to problems. Now, to be fair, technology is a solution to many problems, but it is not necessarily the only solution. And we're tending more and more in society now to rely upon technology to solve problems, particularly complex social problems. Um, an example would be global warming where instead of changing behavior around um, emission of carbon dioxide and um, overconsumption of resources, we look to technology to solve the problem by um, carbon capture or um, putting up uh, things into space that reflect sunlight and reduce the amount of sunlight um, approaching the earth. These sort of technological solutions to behavioral social problems um, is a trend that we're seeing increasing in society. So I've given you a reading, um, the rise of educational technology as a socio-cultural and ideological phenomenon. Go through that reading and we'll discuss this in the tutorials.